So let's talk about one of the trends in waterfowl right now that seems to be pretty big, and I think it's a good trend. I think it's definitely a great direction to go. That is going from the big 12 down to the 20. So I've shot a 20 gauge for the last, I don't know, six or seven seasons. Uh, it's been this little M2 right here in black. I switched to an SB3 this year in 20 because one of my kids started shooting this black one. They really wanted it. They didn't want a new gun. So, but this one, like I said, has five or six seasons on it. This one's got a season on it. So why do I shoot a 20? Uh, I get this a lot on DMs uh, when I post photos. The simplest thing I can say is I shoot a 20 gauge better than I shoot a 12 gauge. The gun just fits me better. So that's why I shoot it. If I, if I shot a 12 gauge better, I would shoot that. Um, so it has nothing to do with it being a little more challenging or any of that. The gun just fits me better. The 20s are a little bit lighter, so they're a little bit easier to handle. I think you do have an advantage with them, uh, especially if you're kind of not a large guy, so, so I'm on the smaller end of like 5'8". There is less recoil in a 20 gauge. We hunt a lot of layout lines, so you know you're not always in the best position when you're shooting out of the layout line. So for me, they handle faster, they handle easier, and there's less recoil. So if birds are finished and they're in tight, it's way easier to go from duck to duck or goose to goose when the barrel's not moving from recoil. So I think that's a huge advantage. Um, I honestly do not see much difference in killing a duck or a goose. I shoot the 20 gauge at big honkers, little geese, specs, uh, all the ducks. I, I honestly I haven't used a 12 gauge during waterfowl season for quite some years. I thought I was almost going to have to last year with the ammo shortage, but I ended up getting through. So, if you shoot a lot of finished ducks, so for me that's 30 yards and in, uh, I don't think you tell the difference between a 20 gauge and a 12 gauge. So the other question I get is, do, we, do I shoot any kind of special shot? Does anybody in the group? And no, we shoot steel. I've shot a little bismuth, but uh, we shoot steel. Uh, twos, threes, ones, I don't care that much. If I had to pick, I'd pick threes probably. And that's for geese as well. And if they're finished, it does, like I said, doesn't seem to make much difference. Uh, that of the SB3, I shoot the factory extended modified. Out of the M2, I've always shot a Carlson's Freemetter out of the M2. So nothing crazy on shot, nothing crazy on shells, nothing crazy on choke tubes. They throw great patterns. There's just not a lot of difference between the two other than the size of the gun. So for me, that's the biggest advantage is the gun just fits me better.